I think that I don't know if you're quite ready for this. How do I? How do I, as your internet internet father, internet padre, bring you to this realization gently and comfortably for maximum growth? Ah, I know, chat. Many weeks ago, I talked about the Ricada Omnibusum, and one of the most important details that came out of this had nothing to do with Ricada. Who did it have to do with? Ethan Ralph. And what was that detail, chat? Well, one of the Kiwi reporters who sat behind Ethan, because Ethan decided to sit front row next to Ricada and his wife, um, one of the reporters sitting directly behind him noticed something. Something peculiar. Something that we've never seen from Ethan Ralph, because he wears sunglasses and a hat indoors all the time. It was that Ethan Ralph was bald. And so... Ethan Ralph, in his infinite wisdom, decided that today would be the day that he would ridicule the Jewish people by wearing a kippah on stream to desecrate this holy religious garment of the Jewish faith. But in so, Yahweh and the Jews had their last laugh because, as you can see, Ethan Ralph is actually fucking bald properly straight up fucking bald and he has a comb over that one can only compare to how you would if you like close your eyes you put your fingers to your temple and you imagine these words irs tax accountant 45 years old comb over that exact mental image will be what you see in front of you on ethan ralph's head that is exactly what he has, the comb-over of a 45-year-old IRS tax accountant. And uh, the kippa, I assume, would also be on the tax accountant's hat. So it just so coincidentally happens to be the same type of hat as well. Um, he, he lied. He straight up lied, because I made fun of this on the Kiwi, uh, the Kiwi Farms Twitter account. He lied and said that this, he's not any more Jewish people this stream. Let's do this again. Chat, can you, can you hear this? Can you hear the luxurious sounds of my thick Italian hair? Because I assure you, it's quite real, chat. <laughs> Ow. Sorry, I tried to put my headset on. it. The left ear cup smacked me in the fucking head. It slipped out of my finger. <laughs> now, Ralph, I'm, I'm trying to be a good boy here and help you out. So when I was, many years ago, when I was uh, a fan of Chantal, and she was not fat and boring, she was fat and sassy still. She had uh, really bad hormonal issues because she was so fat, and she also had her uterus removed, so her her hormonal situation was not good. During her Get Ready With Me streams, where she did her makeup and talked about dumb bullshit like doing coke, um, she would use a product that I had never heard of before. It seems to be a little bit of a niche product, and the people who use it probably don't want to talk about it too much because it's a little bit embarrassing. It's called Kaboki. Now, I don't want to... don't. This is not an advertisement, but I am just trying to help a Neva out, and Ethan Ralph is nothing but a Neva. Uh, you can buy this product and reclaim your confidence, they say. Real results, real reviews... Uh, let's check out one of these. Just out of this is the first one. This is for dark hair. I don't know. Maybe he wants like a gray one because he's already going gray. And get one of those. But I just want to show you the before and after pictures. It's like this weird silicon. Fuck. I fucked up my mic by moving it. It's like a silicon dust, and it's like you see the before and after. You just kind of like it, it kind of like grows and like hairs. You like put it on your head and like pull it out, and it like makes like these spindly natural looking fibers and it kind of fills in your bald spot so um ralph you're you're i mean this is more for women guys just cope and do the comb over this guy this guy's like ethan ralph you see how natural that looks i'm just saying bro you don't have to live like this you don't have to wear the comb over of shame you don't have to wear a hat indoors you can just get some kabuki the 30 gram 90 day supply 
for thirty-five dollars. The, the Ralph and Mel can afford a thirty-five dollar bottle of hair thickener, and then nobody can make fun of you and call you bald. And you can even do cute little get ready with me. Hello? The XLR cable in my microphone just pulled out. <laughs> Bro, this stream is cursed. This is, uh, The Spooktober month is in full force. I am being haunted by the ghost of bald people, I think. Anyways. Um, kill stream. Okay, so this is... I don't know what this is. I think that... Oh. Okay, so what happened is that Ralph did this stream where he showed that he was bald. And he promised his pay pigs that he would wear the Jew cap for the entire week. But then he got pointed out that he was bald as fuck. And he says that he's not going to do it anymore. So I want to hear him cope and seethe for a minute. I missed the beginning of the show. Did Ralph take off the kippah to throw off the Iranian missiles? <laughs> oh, back to the Kansas City Chiefs hat. As if, this motherfucker, by the way, as if the, he's from he's from West Memphis, Arkansas. Kansas City's in Missouri, right? He hasn't, has, has this fat motherfucker ever stepped foot in Missouri? Like, why are you, I don't understand. Why not support the home team? Wear it for the whole week. I'll wear it again one day. I just didn't feel like wearing it today. The Kino oh, Casino hat. I don't have that fucking pin that you're supposed to have to make it stay on your hair. Oh, oh my God. I know exactly what he's talking about. Give me a second. And then yesterday they're like, did, of course the A-logs are like, did Ralph dye his hair? Because my hair was black, and it's like, no, my hair was wet, you idiot. Your hair turns black when it's wet. I don't know if this is a big secret, or... I mean, if it's a darker color, right? Okay, here it is. Here's the other product you gotta buy, bro. It's called Kippa It On. And for some reason, I know... Ex I, for some reason, I know this off the top of my head. The original do-it-yourself in a Kippa clip. America's favorite Kippa clip. It's bra. It's four forty nine for a pack of two. That is a steal. From at that rate, you're stealing from me, brother. So you just put this in and you kip it on. Come on, Ralph. Figure this shit out. Your hair, it, it, it's wet. My hair was wet. And then they're like, Ralph's going bald, which I'm not. My hair is thinner because it's gray in a lot of places. But. Like, Ralph's going bald. Oh, it's like, no, nah, dude, I had a hat on before that. So I went and wet my hair and brushed it. So I didn't, you know, my hair wasn't all fucked up. So that looked like a 45-year-old IRS tax account. I didn't dye my hair. If I did dye it, it'd probably be blonde or something crazy. So, like, it wouldn't be black. Mm, interesting. Cool. Okay, so Ralph in Copesville desperately buying a bottle of Kabuki and a kippa it on. <laughs> and um that's that's all that he's up to. He's being fucking boring again. He needs to start doing pills so he can be more entertaining. I think that's fair to say. Thank you for watching this clip. This is Perspicacity. Remember to like and subscribe.